Now we can do another problem. A convex polygon. What is a convex polygon? A convex polygon means a polygon has five vertices. Five vertices means obviously it has five angles. Right. So a convex polygon has five vertices and five angles. Now sum of angles of a polygon can be obtained. So we can write sum of angles that is equal to n minus 2 multiplied by pi where n is the number of vertices. Here for a convex polygon we have 5 vertices. So sum of angle or total angle that is equal to 5 minus 2 multiplied by pi that is equal to 3 pi 3 pi radian or this is equal to 540 degree so we can continue with the question the question is if the angles that means if the angles of a convex polygon are such that such that a condition is given that means theta 1 less than theta 2 less than theta 3 less than theta 4 less than theta 5 this is a condition on angles is given now our question is we want to find the value of this trigonometric ratio that is sine of theta 1 plus theta 2 divided by sine of theta 3 plus theta 4 plus theta 5. This ratio plus sine of theta 1 plus theta 2 plus theta 3 this divided by sine of obviously the angle become theta 4 plus theta 5 now this is our question we have a convex polygon and a condition or angle is given theta 1 less than theta 2 less than theta 3 less than theta 4 less than theta 5 now we want to find the value of this trigonometric ratio sin theta 1 plus theta 2 divided by sin of theta 3 plus theta 4 plus theta 5 plus sin of theta 1 plus theta 2 plus theta 3 divided by sin of theta 4 plus theta 5 and options are given option a is 1 option b is 2 option c is 3 and option d is obviously 4 we know that for a convex polygon the sum of angles that is theta 1 plus theta 2 plus theta 3 plus theta 4 plus theta 5 this is equal to 3 pi. So we can write the sum of theta 1 plus theta 2. This is equal to 3 pi minus theta 3 plus theta 4 plus theta 5. Right. Now take the sign on both sides. So we get sine of theta 1 plus theta 2 that is equal to sine 3 pi minus theta 3 plus theta 4 plus theta 5 equal to sine of theta 3 plus theta 4 plus theta 5 similarly sine of theta 4 plus theta 5 this is equal to sine of theta 1 plus theta 2 plus theta 3 so our ratio become 1 plus 1 that is equal to 2 
So the correct option is B. Answer is equal to two. 